Reports are claiming the disappearance of classified documents relating to the historic meeting of former President Ma Ying-jeou and Chinese President Xi Jinping. When President Tsai Ing-wen took office six months after the 2015 summit, her administration received documents relating to the meeting. But now reports claim that the key material was missing. And Ma's office denies the claims and has suggested they, that they are part of a smear campaign. Former President Ma Ying-jeou was at Suzhou University to lecture on the handling of cross-strait fraud cases. When asked about newspaper reports accusing him of failing to give President Tsai Ing-wen classified documents relating to his 2015 meeting with Xi Jinping, Ma gave a laconic reply. My office has already made a clear statement. Ma met the Chinese president in Singapore on November the 7th, 2015. Now reports are alleging that documents concerning how the meeting came about and how the two sides interacted prior to the summit are nowhere to be found, leading to suspicions that the former government covered up key material. The current president and all those working at the presidential office must investigate exactly which documents that should have been handed over were in fact not. Failure to hand over such documents entails criminal liability. If any criminal offenses are involved, the case should be handed over to investigative authorities to sort out. This may have violated the National Security Act or laws concerning classified documents. Ma's office issued a press release in response to the claims, saying that at the time, he ordered communication on the matter to be conducted through official channels and that the process should be public and transparent. He says the current controversy is a deliberate smear campaign by President Tsai Ing-wen. Her office retorted with its own press release, saying officials from Ma's administration ought to make a clear statement on whether any documents were left out of the handover.